When I was doing my selection process within the uh, careers uh, setup, I decided that Remy was the cat badge that had challenged me every day. It engaged me and all of the work I'd be doing would be rewarded. I'd be able to see the results straight away. Uh, I'd be surrounded by bright people and I think Remy, the transferable skills I'd take away from it would be excellent. Well, we're attached to the Army Air Corps. We work alongside the RLC for logistical support. We also work with the Royal Signals for communications. I've deployed abroad a lot with the Army uh, on exercise and adventurous training, probably more than my fair share if I'm honest. Uh, from Norway, Nordic skiing, Chamonix rock climbing, Austria, Austria snowboarding, uh, you know, to name but a few. And then with rugby, I've also done rugby tours to Portugal. I uh, went to Cancun during spring break, um, which was an excellent rugby experience. And bringing up the Mexican locals, um, showing them the sport and like, developing them was uh, fantastic. I've also deployed on Herrick 19 for four and a half months, uh, which was mentally and physically very challenging, but rewarding at the end of it. Uh, I play rugby within the army. I've travelled to Portugal and also Mexico to represent the Rimi. Uh, playing rugby and also things like mountain climbing and caving and a wide scope of other things that the army also offer. The most exciting thing I've done is probably actually deploying on Op Herrick. Um, the excitement of uh, there's a danger aspect and you really feel like you've got a purpose. You're doing your job for a reason. It you know, really hits home when you're out there. I think, aside from the uh, overall intelligence that's sort of assumed among all Rumi soldiers, it's the adaptability. So we can do any job with a little bit of, uh, you know, thought and hard work, we can sort of get around any engineering problems uh, and just create something that works, uh, you know, and the operational capability of every unit, I'd say, is upheld by Remi. Worked along many different companies, including um, Boeing, uh, Augusta, Westland, uh, and also the civilian contractors that are here with me on this base that um, work on the Apache. All of the engineering skills that I've gained and qualifications look fantastic to any employer. For my young age to have the engineering background I now do uh, is brilliant. But I think alongside that, it's all of the military discipline and core values that an employer looks for and has come to expect from soldiers. It makes me far more employable than someone similarly qualified uh, who's a civilian. Well, as a Lance Corporal avionic technician, I have had chances to man five, six man teams in uh, maintaining the Apache aircraft. I think as long as you're, you know, you've been selected for it, just being fit enough, strong enough to manage with the job that you've uh, given. Uh, as long as you're switched on and sociable, you'll uh, rise to the top. Uh, first of all, what I'd say is uh, make sure you're fit. Um, it's going to be challenging. And also, if you're going to be a Remy tradesman, ensure that you're willing to work hard at, at your job because it will be mentally challenging as well. I'd say go for it. I think the Remy is a brilliant call and the opportunities and qualifications are endless.